Installing your Venmar Bistro range hood is quick, easy, and only requires one person. Before you begin, make sure you have all the tools you'll need. Measuring tape, Phillips screwdriver, flathead screwdriver, drill with a 1 8 inch bit, 7 64 inch bit, 3 8 inch bit, and a 1 half inch hole saw, a jigsaw, sheet metal shears, pliers, metal foil duct tape, scissors, pencil, wire stripper, strain relief, and safety gear. To prepare the hood for installation, remove the grease filters. Remove the screws holding the damper assembly to the hood, the parts bag, and the damper assembly inside the hood. Remove the wire cover, the round duct plate, and the electrical power cable knockout. There are four options for ducting your range hood, vertical, horizontal, round, and ductless. For vertical ducting using the included damper, remove the three and a quarter inch knockout on top of the hood. Attach the damper to the hood. Attach a small piece of ducting to the top of the damper and seal the connection using metal foil duct tape. For horizontal ducting using the damper, remove the rectangular knockout on the back of the hood. For vertical ducting using round duct pipe, remove the round duct knockout on top of the hood. Then replace the duct plate and attach the duct pipe to the hood using metal foil duct tape making sure the joint is airtight. For ductless installation, remove the three screws holding the recirculation cover plate to the hood. Discard the plate and the screws. No other duct knockouts should be removed for ductless installation. Use the included template to mark the cabinet for the hood. Measure and mark the hood's center line on the bottom of the cabinet. Then, line up the template with the line that you drew on the cabinet. If you have a framed cabinet, fold over the rear edge of the template so the depth matches the cabinet frame at the wall. Drill a 1 8 inch pilot hole for house wiring at A location on the template. Use a sharp pencil or a 1 8 inch drill bit to mark the points along the duct access hole. Remove the template from the cabinet. Connect the dots to draw the border for the exhaust ducting. Drill a 3 8 inch hole at a point along the line to start the jigsaw cut, then cut the opening with the jigsaw. Use the included Easy one brackets for the installation. There are four included brackets, two for framed cabinets and two for frameless cabinets. The brackets are engraved to tell you which one goes on which side. Hold the bracket up to the cabinet, making sure the back of the bracket is against the back wall, then mark three screw holes. Use a 7 64 inch drill bit to drill pilot holes at your pencil marks. Then secure the brackets with included wood screws. Attach the strain relief to the hood, then pull the house power cable through. Simply slide the hood onto the Easy one brackets, which will hold the hood in place until you complete the installation. When installing duct or electrical from the back, Use the rear Easy one slots on the hood to temporarily hold the hood in place while wiring or finishing the duct. Hang the hood on the brackets through the front recessed holes on top of the hood. Secure the hood to the bracket with the four included screws. Connect the house power cable to the range hood wiring by connecting black to black, white to white, and green or bare wire under the green ground screw. Replace the wiring cover and attach it to the hood with the retaining screw. Replace the grease filters. For ductless installation, you'll need to purchase non-ducted filters from a local retailer and install according to their instructions. Your Venmar Bistro range hood is ready for use.